Twin Savage Games here, played in seven Titan attacks. Now this is gonna be overall my opinion on the game. Now I hope my concern, my thoughts. Hope you for any of your concerns or decisions if you think this game would be worth your time playing. Now should I start with the positives or negatives as well? Everyone loves the negatives, so I'll say that this game is just overall easy. It's not challenging. When like when you have everything upgraded, your ship completely maxed out, you're unstoppable. You can't be stopped. It's it's, it's impossible. You can complete the waves over and over again, your upgrades will carry over all over again. They will carry over, so you don't have to start over. You can keep going, keep going, try to get to the leaderboard. You can get to first place even on the leaderboards, which is, well, really tie for the leaderboards, which is just like 999, just a bunch of nines. <laughs> it's like, yeah, that's no problem. Like, you can pause the game, you can turn it off, and you can still start off from where you left off. So, yeah, it's it's really possible. <laughs> Overall, if you were looking for a challenge in the game, like in an arcade shooter such as this, and this has got to be the easiest, and you won't really get much of a challenge for this. Early early waves, though, when you first start off, it's pretty tough. Because alien ships take a lot of shots to hit, and you only, like, shoot one bullet at a time. So, <laughs> that's when it's really challenging, especially in the boss battles. Remember that once you get everything, once you get all the cash by shooting launchers, completing these little challenges where you have to try to shoot all the saucers, and the well you do, the higher your pri prize is, or the best your prize gets, you get more points or more cash. Or catching aliens that fall off their ships when you destroy them. If you miss them, you lose money. If you catch them, you gain money. And you shoot the saucers that pass by the like above everyone like that there that I missed you get cash or bonus weapon upgrade that will last for the entire wave or just more points and you lose your your bonus multiplier which gives you more points and you lose it when you get hit once he said you don't want to try to get hit and but at the higher levels you're able just to spam bombs like crazy just to use a bomb and to destroy everyone in just one go. Because <laughs> everything that you see on the screen now is pretty much all that you're going to have to face throughout that whole wave. Pretty much. Um, what else is there? Oh yeah, the positives. We almost forgot to mention those. The sound, the music, the quality. Well, the, no, the details. I just like the details. The visual, the colors, the sci-fi colors, I love it. <laughs> the music fits my jam just nicely because I'm all into that whole sci-fi techno stuff, so fits my jam there. And this is an alien. This is about this is those battle spells where you're able to shoot parts of the enemy. Sh the guns, parts of the <laughs> guns off the enemy ship, which they shoot less missiles at you and stuff. Or you can just completely go for the hull once you shoot the exterior part that covers it, so you can destroy the ship completely. It's gonna take a lot of hits at early waves, but later it's, it's a cakewalk. It's nothing. It's easy. Overall, if you're looking for challenge, this will not fit your suitings when you get to this point. <laughs> In the game. And I'm not sure what else there's discussed about. I already taught saying that I like the sound of the game. It's artwork. It's it's music. It's sound. So yeah, I would not recommend you buy this game though. I got this game for free on PS Plus, and if it's still free, you can try it out. But overall, I wouldn't waste your your money if you if you just want entertainment for just 30 minutes or just an hour. Then I suppose you can waste 10 bucks on this game, or how much its current price is. 
but yeah. Other than that, I wouldn't recommend it. You can try it out for if it's ever free again. And I'll be all. Thanks for watching, and I hope I made up your decision if you're thinking about getting the game or not. So if you have any more questions or concerns, you can feel free to comment below on whatever you like to say. And I hope you have a good day. I